For those of you out there who happen to be Maya users, you are a bit in luck because there is a special form of viewport navigation for the perspective viewport that mimics Maya behavior. Now, currently, I'm inside VCTF Sandstorm, which you can open up if you'd like to follow along, and I have activated game view mode just because it makes the viewport look so nice. I'm also going to maximize the viewport, make everything nice and big. Now, to activate Maya-style viewport navigation, you have two options here. The first is you can hold down the U key. And now while I'm holding down U, the behavior of my mouse buttons will change. Now while I'm holding down U, left mouse will rotate the camera around. Right mouse will allow me to dolly the camera in and out. And middle mouse, which is actually your mouse wheel, if you click on that, that's going to slide your camera left, right, and in its own local up and down axis. So kind of like in a plane that is oriented to the camera. Now what I mean by that is if I'm looking straight down and I drag with middle mouse, you'll notice I'm just kind of tracking along the ground. If I rotate the camera up and I use the same middle mouse button, same thing, I'm actually sliding down. So we're actually kind of sliding along a plane that orients itself along with the camera. So again, that's left to rotate the mouse, right to dolly in and out, and then middle to kind of slide along its own local plane. Now, that's very cool. It's almost just like Maya. However, in Maya, you might be more used to uh, tumbling around an object with the left mouse button. So what we're going to do is use the L key. This is our other Maya navigation button. And if I have an object selected and I hold the L key and start dragging with left mouse, it snaps the camera around that object's pivot so we can now tumble around that object. So if I grab this little static mesh here on the side, hold down L, and then drag, we're now rotating around that mesh, which can be very handy, especially if you're trying to get an idea of how something is positioned relative to other objects in your level. Now, that's with left mouse button, I'm tumbling. Right mouse, I can dolly toward and away from that object. And then middle mouse, again, just kind of allows me to slide around a local plane. So if you're used to Maya-style viewport navigation and you'd rather use that than the standard left, right, and left and right together middle mouse buttons, you have that option and that will wrap things up for this video. This